Hey, speaking of the spinning wheels, all week long we've been testing out different craft type things for Easter. Maybe you're like, hey, we want to do some things, decorate some eggs with the kiddos. Uh, and we're always looking for new stuff. So on Monday, we tried Cadbury cream egg s'mores. Yesterday, we also made these uh, dyed eggs using Kool-Aid liquid. I think we've got some pictures for you of those. Yeah, so do you remember this though, back in March, we made fizzy green eggs in honor of Read Across America Day. We used baking soda and food coloring to make the eggs, then drip vinegar over them, and it was really fun because we watched them bubble. Well, that is kind of the same idea behind today's craft. Take a look here. A woman named Kelly Oster posted this video on her Instagram. Uh, you make paint using baking soda, water, and food coloring. And you can make as many different colors as you want, Kristen. All right. Well, you need your hard-boiled eggs. You need baking soda, water, food coloring, gel if you have it, because mm -hmm. they say that works best, uh, and vinegar. Yes. Okay? So that's for the dye that you're going to make. And you'll want a couple of muffin tins. We yes. have them here. Uh, if you only have one, then you can make the paint in small bowls and then use the one tin for the eggs. You also s need some paint brushes, right? Yep. Uh, and a dropper or some small cups for drizzling the vinegar, which we have right here. So let's jump in by making the paint. What okay. do you say? Yeah. All right, so you're going to start with that one tablespoon of baking soda and one teaspoon of water. And that is what is mixed together in these tin cups here inside this muffin pan, right? It looks like frosting and it makes me want to eat it. It's, it's like not, it's not. It's not as edible. <laughs> this is actually a really good consistency here for this one. Sometimes they get a little thicker. Producer Heidi had mixed it together. She said, just keep stirring, you know, if it's a little thick. Mm -hmm. um, but it, it works out. So then is the fun part. Okay. We make the colors. Okay. And you can do whatever color you want. So if you want to grab three, I'll grab three. We'll just okay. go in here. Go ahead, you go first. Green here. You got neon green. Uh, that was the thing with the dyed eggs yesterday when we did Kool Aid. We felt like the colors maybe were the hardest part of really, you know, wanting them to look more Eastery. Yeah. Um, they didn't really have a ton of Easter colors. The more intense, the more color you use, as you know, the more mm -hmm. intense the color will be. So, go I like this green. blue. That's a pretty blue. Mm -hmm. All right. I do like this egg that um, producer Heidi's you tried. That pink? pink. That's really pretty. Yeah. So I'll do some pink. I'll do yellow. Okay. For funsies. I should have brought my whiskey over here. <laughs> You'll have your coffee soon. And then you can mix them both together, uh, right? I promise I won't do it. All right, here we go. Oh, that's and good. It is a really pretty yellow, too. We got the pink. What do you want? Um, do you have, we have purple? Mm, no. All we right, have red or orange. Let's go orange. You want orange? All right. I'll do red. All right. Oh, yeah. producer Heidi's so smart. She said we could do red and blue and make purple. So you I'll do, do that. purple and I'll do the orange up here. Yeah. Like we still little. haven't gotten to our eggs yet. I have a whole carton in the fridge because we've got to we've got to decorate and dye them. But we have not gotten them. Oh, at your yet. house? Yep. So I think I might want to try this. Okay. Well, we might want to wait and see how we'll it works. We'll see how it goes first. out. But I mean, it looks like you know, so far so good. These are great colors. I don't know if I did the right ratio. I think I made black. That's all right. That's <laughs> I'm all right. Add I'm a little grab more red. Okay. You okay. start going. All right. I'm gonna go here. Okay, so we're going to start painting. And then this is, it's, uh, Producer Heidi also said when she was trying it that sometimes the color may look, you know, a little bit lighter or darker depending on, you know, as you're first um, getting it on the egg. But when you add the vinegar, obviously that's going to yeah, the whole a fun reaction. Right. The whole point of these is to, to paint your egg and then we're going to make it kind of do a fun thing. Mm-hmm. Put this green here. I did, definitely did not make purple, but I like this color that I did make. And I think we can just mix these colors together here. I'm gonna go like a green pink blend. Oh, I do like that. Is a that's like a teal. Mm -hmm. I love that. It wasn't totally intentional. But you know what? Sometimes the best accidents mm -hmm. work out perfect. And it's like a little um, like sticky or something. I don't know. Mm -hmm. it's like a little grainy. See what this does to the fingers here in a minute. I haven't quite yeah. figured that out tried yet. To, tried right. to not. So now, okay. I'm going to try this reaction. Okay. I've got a bunch of green and pink on this particular egg. Yeah, it's hard to do it with it just in the thing. Yep. You but it also contains the mess. I really do like that. Okay, this, yeah. So. That's good mom advice. Yes. <laughs> Contain the mess. Um, okay. Yeah. I got this here. I, hope, I think you, if, I don't, yeah. You, this is, no, I don't love this. All right, here we go. I'm dropping the vinegar on. Oh, so wait, explain that. Yes, so after you finish painting it, 
Then you get to take the vinegar and the droplet. You can pour all over the egg or you can just do drops of it, which helps it set. Look at how pretty that is. It's like a watercolor. <gasps> do you hear the fizz? Can you hear it? <laughs> they, like, they turn the music down. That's good. Look at that. And then it Kay. washes off the excess. Oh my gosh, I love these. Look at that. It's like it a watercolor. Really All right, let's see. Oh, uh, look at that. That's gorgeous. This is a win. Okay, so then we um, have to rinse them off because you don't want, you know, you want to rinse them off, get all the excess off. Off the vinegar, yep. And then we let them dry. So we're going to take a break. We're going to rinse our eggs. Might be painting another one because that really is cool. Really I is like cool. this one. Yeah. Um, and then we'll come back. Let's do it. Okay.